I love the bass because if you're in doubt, you just go. Oh. oh. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Both ways. <laughs> it works both ways, <laughs> up or down. <laughs> Welcome to All About the Bass. Hello. I am Pete. And I'm Lee. <laughs> so, oh, and I, so I'm gonna I'm gonna say what Nathan always says. Do, so, what are we looking at today, Lee? Well, Nathan. <laughs> <laughs> okay. No. So we have Mustang basses. Mustang, Mustang basses. Mustang basses. Mustang basses, isn't it? <laughs> it's the it's only bass line you're allowed Mustangs to play. Out. We were like, we've gone through the American performer, jazz bass and the P bass. So we, we looked at those and these came in just after. So we thought we'd just okay. have a little look. And seeing as you were around, mate, as well, and we're doing this, like just how, how easy it is for you as a guitarist to come and go, actually, this is easy or I prefer. Difficult. I prefer these, I prefer this to a, to a full size jazz bass. Cause yeah. it's just, it's just, much easier to sit with. Yeah, yeah. No, straight away. It's got that. Um, it's not long. No, no it's no, no. like it's it's much more guitarry. Yeah, uh, <laughs> it's not. It doesn't weigh as much. You know, very very light. Yeah. No, very. And this is it. And so, for those who don't know, so short scale basses. We're talking about um, basses that have got a thirty inch scale length normally around around that sort of sort 30. of thirty. Thirty inches. Uh, yes. Thirty inches. So a guitar is like if you know a Strat, it's twenty five and a half. Yeah. So it's only yeah. slightly longer than a. Than a strat. That's it. And you're looking normally where say a normal long scale bass is 34 inches. So you actually. Oh, no more than that. Yeah. No, oh, I inches. thought it was much bigger than that. It feels much bigger. Only four inches. <laughs> Only four inches. But that's about so that much, isn't it, Lee? Oh yeah. <laughs> Too right. You <laughs> know me. This much. <laughs> <laughs> um, so this is yeah, absolutely, man. So short scale basses. Um, these came through um, originally designed in the sort of fifties and sixties. Yeah. As something that is just easier just to get on with, or smaller to, to travel around with. Yeah. Um, but for any any guitarist, is great if you're trying to look, come, you know, come over to the bass side, come over to the dark side. Um, you have uh, <laughs> make it, makes it easier for you, you know, just yeah. to get into that, into the groove with it. Yeah. Um, but they do have their own unique sound, you know, come taken away from the pickups and everything that's, that's involved. But yeah. just having that that shorter scale length gives it this extra kind of little brightness to the sound. That it's a different thing to play, isn't it? So, uh, yeah. uh, so this is the American one, right? So yes. The Mexican one and an American one. Yep. And that's this the is the made. This is made in Corona, California. It is indeed. This is, is brand new for this year. Is that, yeah. Is that one burgundy uh, mist? It, it's aubergine, mate. Aubergine. Aubergine. Yeah, I like, I like it. I think it's pretty cool. It's, I oh, thought mate, I was going to say it was burgundy, but burgundy is probably light, light, I don't know. Yeah, man, no, no, aubergine. I, I do. Aubergine. Aubergine. You can also get them in sunburst. Uh, there's a satin oh. surf green. 
and an oh. Arctic White as well. Arctic <laughs> White. <laughs> That was just the hats off to uh, Matt and Rabia on, uh, and that sounds like, <laughs> it's Arctic <laughs> white. Uh, <laughs> if you don't know what I'm talking about, uh, yeah. type in, is it, it's, anyway, it's, it's, it's one of the sound like videos and Matt keeps saying it's Arctic, Arctic white when it's, when it's Olympic white. So anyway, anyway so, so yeah. This is, yeah, so American Performer Series um, last year, or the beginning, the beginning of this year, sort of replaced the American Special range from the guitars, and they've taken the opportunity to bring back um, some basses in that, in that model as well, in that range okay. as well, sorry. So this is coming about 969 for an American-made Mustang bass. Okay. Um, and the one I've got in my hands is the Mexican PJ Offset bass, which is, it's still a Mustang, as you can see, similar sort of style, it's the same yeah. sort of scale length. Um, Slightly different configuration with the the controls. Uh, yeah, the, uh, so I'm spot. What I what I'm spotting is mm. different pickups. Yep. Uh, you've got a selector switch I for do. your pickups. I have got uh, string through body, <gasps> uh, which is uh, you know uh, like a Telecaster. I like that. Mm -hmm. I have got some like nicer tuners there. They you can see are lightweight tuners, mate, as these, well to make it as light as possible. Yeah, these are more your standard. And I've got, trainers. you've got a truss rod which is laid in, uh, mine is laid in and then the fingerboard is put on top of it which means that the the adjustment is down here yep. where yours is there. Up at the so I think they lay, laid in the back yeah, cool. afterwards like that. Nice. Um, and then... You've got different hardware, this is a cool little design, this nice chunky big bridge for this one so you yeah, get a little bit more sustain from that. Lot of, lot of, and, and with the whole uh, uh, string yeah, through thing. Definitely. And then I can't throw mine in the bin. <laughs> it's, uh, it's because it's neither can I. Too, oh, you can't either. No, no, I can't oh, either. Oh, you can't either. Oh, okay. Oh. Well. Oh, well, it looks like we're keeping them. Yeah, that's it. And the scratch plate is, uh, oh. is slightly. It's a little more blingy. Is it different? It is a little mint green, and you've got like the pearl oil. Oh, it's the same, it's the same, it's the same. Same shape. shape. Yeah. But so yeah, this this control. So I've got the, the pickup selector, and you've on one volume, one tone. Yeah. So um, I can select yeah neck pickup both or bridge. Yeah. Uh, and then volume and tone for each. You've okay. Got, I like, can blend. Yeah, you've got more of that jazz bass setup where it's a volume for each pickup and then a tone. Ah, I see. I see. So I can blend in the back pickup like that. Yeah. I'm also noticing because uh, I don't know anything about this, ladies and gentlemen. Although I seem like I know everything about it. <laughs> Uh, I'm noticing rosewood fingerboard. You're right, and there, you mate. have got uh, Power Ferro. I do. Or yes. is it? Or is it Laurel? Uh, no, this is Power Ferro. Okay. Yeah, Power Ferro board they use on this. So everything else, maple neck like you got on there. All the bodies. Um, it's yours, so, lacquered. Mine is uh, slightly um, satin. Nice, kind of like thing. a nice, nice little satin yeah. urethane finish. Polly, you are a thane. Polly, you are a thane. Okay, well let's have a listen to what you okay. can make it sound like. Then I'll hand you this and then we'll see what the difference is. Sweet mate. Right, so I will start on back pickup uh, with the tone on and volume on. So. <laughs> Both at the same time, tone on. Peaks. Bah, 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 bah. Oh yeah. I, I like that. I think that's really nice. Yeah. And you know what I like about it? I like that it's that it's that switchy switch thing. Yeah, I, I, do you know what? That's, that's I don't know if quite I prefer a quick, that. quick way. I think I want. Yeah. 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 Let's see what we've done. Thank you. Pass me the aubergine. Same sort of weight. Neck. Is, is that slimmer neck on this? Feels slightly uh, slimmer. Oh, you're right, mate. Actually, yeah. To, 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 towards the middle, it sounds, yeah. feels like it gets a little bit larger, but. Still really. I, here's really. here's a, here's a quick one I've noticed on here is that this <gasps> on the for front. that is this is your little tone control. Oh yeah, yeah that's where they put that the instead. same plate. So it's the same plate ah, that looks like a thumb. 
Look at that. that. This thing looks like a thumb. It does. Oh, turn down. Yeah. <laughs> or something else. <laughs> so, Let's have a listen. Let's have a listen. Does that scrap blade and that color make it sound different and better? Or mm. not? Well, it, obviously, it, it must. And this is about 500 quid, you said? You're around 500 quid, mate. This Look at the links. They always change. And that's about 900 ish. Nine -ish. Osh. Osh. Let's have a listen. Cool. Right, this is both. Actually, let's start back, pick up, tone on again, like we did on that one. Yes. <laughs> Fluff. More honky. More honky, it is, mate, isn't it? It's more honky. In it, mate. Yes, it is, mate. <laughs> in it, mate. Yes. In it. That's more that jazz bass yeah. thing, that real. Yeah. Nice. Yeah, much more. Much more honky. Yeah, you're extra cool. Anyway, so anyway. Yeah, go on, go on, go on. Um, both pickups on tone on. Both. <laughs> Tone off. That's quite nice actually, because you still got the clarity. That's yep. that's fully turned clarity. off. Clarity, clarity <laughs> is working <laughs> against <laughs> me now. <laughs> <laughs> and we have neck pick up. Uh, tone on. Yes, mate, <laughs> love it. <laughs> <laughs> My yeah. God, I was completely lost. So you hear me go, <laughs> yeah, all, and then all, I got all, it. All um, this is the, def, de, that's definitely to me better. You, yeah, when yeah. you're playing it as well. Yeah. Did you get through all of it or no? no just one more. Just one, one more. more. It's just neck with tone off. So. Uh, You got more clarity. Yeah, though. it is still, you know, it's not really nasal, like nasally and muffled. <laughs> yeah, it's. My, I think I actually I do prefer that. I must admit. And also, yeah. if you are uh, if you are taking it out uh, in the rain, it comes with the, these little raincoats. Don't the forget your shooting peg condoms. Yeah, exactly. Never leave home without. Them. <laughs> I, I like that. I, yeah. this, this feel it feels. I mean, that's it. Feels good. It's great base. It feels good. Quid. Neck is definitely slimmer. So if you've got smaller hands then you can, yeah. you know, you'll probably go for this one. Yeah. Um, but I would, if I, if money was no object, I would definitely, think and I was looking for, for uh, e either of these two, I would, but that's, I think that's always the same thing, isn't it? I mean, if, if it wasn't, then would it, why would yeah. they make both? Yeah, that, no, it's you true, know. it's true. And it's, it's one of these things, say, again, it, you might come in and try these, or, you know, and yeah. you just, you throw that one over these, but actually, I'm in agreement, mate. This is this is yeah, a beautifully, the, yeah, beautifully and this, made this the, the fact is, you you got the string through the body, you know, you have much more resonance. You've got a bigger plate that sits onto the yep. body on that one, which means that there's much more resonance going from the strings into the neck. Yeah. Know. So, I mean, yes, 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 yes. yes. That but was, mate, that, I mean. So um, I think we do have to play Mustang Sally out because <gasps> we are we are playing Mustang basses. Cool and we're going to do that? Yeah. Go on so uh, so this, this is a Mexican uh, uh, Mustang. Austin, PJ Mustang. That's it. 
So why is it called an offset when that's not called an upset? I have no idea. So they, they did last year, they released the Mexican offset range, which they brought out, you know, the um, and the guitars as well. You've got yes, the, yeah, 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 yeah. All the Mustangs and the um, uh, Duo Sonic and all that sort of stuff. So it's a part of that range. Yeah, So okay. it's got the offset thing, but yeah. yeah but it is the well. same, but it's, it's the same. same. Thing. Yeah. But they change all the time. They like to confuse yeah, us. Yeah, they do. Anyway, <laughs> thank you very much for watching this video. Yeah. If you found it interesting, please subscribe for more stupid shenanigans like this. Uh, hit the bell. Hit the bell. And uh, subscribe. Yeah, man. Yeah. yeah. And see we'll you see you shortly. What a day. Ha, 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 ha.